Welcome back to London and welcome back to the McLaren 720S. You'll have to forgive the uh, quick and sneaky departure from NVN London. Uh, reason being we're halfway through a sort of phase two of a pretty big development uh, in NVN and I don't want to really show it to you until it's looking a bit more complete so it makes sense. Anyway, I've not long got back from Dubai. I'm not actually feeling that festive. Now, a little bit of a personal insider to me, I love Christmas. <laughs> I just love it. And honestly, being out in Dubai, while it's been amazing, uh, that festive spirit just kind of isn't here right now. If there's ever a cure for that, it is central London during Christmas time. So MVN is on its doorstep. We're going to drive the 720S into town and immerse you and myself in this wonderful city at this wonderful time of the year. Let's hit it. managed to find parking uh, near Oxford Street at Christmas. Bonkers around here this time of year. Might have been a slight mistake bringing the 720 into town. However, in previous content, I did say that I was gonna live with this car, which means Christmas shopping, which means bringing it into town, parking it in underground car parks, and just living with the car. So you don't get more sort of inconvenient than this. Oxford Street during Christmas, that thing's been awesome. Anyway, let's head up top. December, would you? You would not believe it's December. So, having complained about just coming back from Dubai, it's 15 degrees here in the evening in December. I'm happy about it. Yeah, you know, because la la last time, not last this time last year, not so much, man. It was like intense snowstorm. Yeah. Which, on the one hand, gives you a bit of festive vibe. On the other hand, don't want to get any cars out. You know. So tomorrow, and the reason that we're in town with the 720S is that we are going to MTC, which is the McLaren Technology Center, um, for the launch of something pretty cool and interesting. Actually, a tech piece, which is new. It's something we've never really like shared or shown before, but there's a, a new piece of tech which we'll share with you tomorrow. So we're going to sync our hot chocolates now, uh, which I must say are really good, <laughs> next level good actually. And then we're going to do some shopping, and then we'll stop by the MVN apartment, show you around there, and. Yeah, who knows what's going to unfold next? Alright, we are out of Central. As much as I love being in London, every time I drive through it, I realise that it is a stressful game of avoiding each other. It's bonkers and the freedom of movement in London, I swear it's getting worse. I lived in London for about, it was around about seven years actually on and off and uh, I'm pretty sure when I was here it wasn't that intense. Getting out of like the Oxford Street area, there's like mopeds going across the road while someone's carrying a suitcase while there's cars coming the other way and people are stopped halfway in the road while the lights have changed and buses are coming and honking at everyone. Hey, Merry Christmas man. <laughs> Okay, back to the apartment. For those of you guys that caught some content a couple of weeks ago, you'll know that we have this crazy underground car lift system, which is pretty awesome. Although we have this turntable, which means we have to shuffle the car around in this tight environment. It's just another byproduct of living in London. Although I've got to say, I never tire of it. There's something really fun about shuffling into this car lift. Speaking of which, doors open now. I got this down to a fine art. Woo! <laughs> Look at that. 
Uh, that's about the tightest space I'm going to be finding in London anytime soon. These doors, man, they've done a really good job of making them, you know, usable. It's pretty cool. That is a, I mean, that's a snug fit, though. That's a snug fit. Anyway, let's go check out the apartment. What's up, guys? I'm Mr. JWW, and this is my crib. I'm starting to show my age now with that MTV reference, but I couldn't help myself. Check it out. That's why we need more sitting spaces. More seats. And probably the Apollo lounge. <laughs> we definitely need an Apollo. If you guys haven't watched the video before this, comments below. Go, go see the video and then just put your votes in for the Apollo pod. You'll see what I mean. It's bonkers. And we really want one. <laughs> so as you can see, this is like the battle station where we all, after work, we still keep working. This is why we have a place in London. Basically, Marek flies over from Dubai for how often do you come? Like twice a month right now. Twice like, a month. Right, three for about a week month. at a time or a bit longer than that? A week in Dubai, that? three weeks in London. Three weeks in London, a week that's in Dubai. It. Man, that's dedication, man. You make me feel bad. I just drive up and down the motorway a bit. You know? And, <laughs> and economy guys, by the way. Economy uh, class, for sure. Economy, every little counts, man. That's everything we save on flights, we put towards flooring and sofas. Yeah, so. We chose this place because of its convenient location to MVN. It's not too far. We just jump on the West Way and we're pretty much there, which is cool. But also trying to find a place like this, take it from me, we got such a good deal on this place. Uh, now I've lived in London for about seven years and to find a place like this and the deal we got it for is bonkers. So as soon as we got it, we snapped it up and we were so thankful for that. So. Who knows how long we'll be here, but I'm just happy to be here. We've dusted off the desert and immersed ourselves in some Christmas activities in London. Feeling good, feeling like I'm back just in time for Christmas. Now I know the tour of the apartment was brief, but I just wanted to dip you in there and share it with you. And you might be wondering, why are you not staying there right now? Are you driving somewhere else? Reason being, the event at MTC tomorrow at the McLaren Technology Center is super fresh and early in the morning. McLaren have very kindly offered to put us up in a hotel just next door. So I am all up for accepting that invite so that I don't have to get up at the crack of dawn in order to queue in the traffic on the M25 to make the event. I think it starts at 8 a.m. So we'd have to leave London way earlier than I would like to tomorrow morning. Okay, made it to my room. The irony is both myself and Peyton had separate rooms booked so that we could have our own beds and yet I have twins in my own room. Anyway, on that note, I'm going to call it a night and I shall see you next time. Be sure to like and subscribe. Your subscriptions are my oxygen. Ciao. <laughs>